All right, guys, so in this video, let's talk about foundation problems. How do you know if your house has them? Here's the first little trick that you may have seen before. You put a ball down on the floor, and if it just starts to roll by itself, then you know the floor is not level, and that could be a sign of foundation issues. Another thing you can look for is if you look at the top of the door there, you see how that gap's not straight anymore. It's smaller on one side than the, than the other. That's also a, a sign of possible foundation problems. If we go into my closet here, back in the corner you can see where the drywall seam has cracked. And that's because the outside of the house is starting to settle. See it's pretty obvious up there too. And even some cracks formed over the doorway. And in this corner. See these kinds of cracks, they're all a sign that you might have a foundation problem. Here in the master bathroom, if the lighting would cooperate, you can see more signs of cracking in the corner. Now we're in the room that used to be the termite damage room and we're looking at a closet door that I put in. And when I installed it, it was perfectly plumb with the door frame here. But now you can see a pretty big gap that's formed. And if you look up top here, you can see a crack that formed in the drywall too. Those are all signs that this side of the house has settled a little bit. So now we're in the bathroom and it can be a little bit more difficult to tell in here if there's foundation problems because you have, you know, the tubs in the way. Now you can't really see, I mean, there's these cracks in the corner, which is a sign. See both corners have these cracks. And then if you look over here, you can see another crack and it, you can kind of tell that it's separated. So that is a good indicator that this side is starting to sink. And that's why there's a gap forming here. Now one last example I want to show you is sometimes your baseboard can show some separation. Like in this case, there is a bead of caulk that was run along the baseboard here. And you can see how far that's actually separated from the baseboard. This, again, is a sign of foundation problems. And to double check that, we can do the ball trick again. And without giving the ball any kind of a push or anything, you saw it just roll right down to the corner there. Now if you go to the exterior of the house, one telltale sign is a stair step pattern forming in your brick. If you see this kind of a stair step cracking in your mortar joints on your brick, then this is a really obvious sign that you have foundation problems. So these are just some of the signs of foundation issues that I've noticed in my house. And I just figured I'd do a short video here and just share them with you. So that hopefully if you were wondering with your house or maybe you're trying to buy a house and you want to make sure you don't buy one with foundation issues, these are some of the things you can look for. So I hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.